First and foremost, it's just a really fun event for students um, to compete against one another. We had 14 teams come from all over the world to Denver, Colorado. I think a great experience that prepared us uh, for the formula, if you will, of how you might present your position in a particular case. I think also the fact that it's the only event like it's uh, uh, structured like this in the country, we actually bring a case, a business case, that focuses on the things that we care a lot about, ethics and leadership. Course is clear. Racers ready. Three, two, one, go. Combined with alpine skiing, uh, it's just a great opportunity for students to come together and do something a little unique. Not only affords us the opportunity to come to the US, but mixes sort of the ethical sustainability elements which we don't regularly see in competitions and also gives us the chance to get up on the mountains as well. They applied their critical thinking skills and their technical skills, their presentation skills and their communication skills. And then they came up to the mountains and they raced. And while the race isn't the important piece, it was the idea that they were building relationships. Uh, they faced a lot of judges that are from the Denver area. The students were handling uh, the Chipotle uh, situation which is like real time and the thoughts, the ideas uh, that went into this was really, really exciting. The elements of the case uh, in terms of leadership and, um, and, and focusing on um, dealing with very serious ethical dilemmas and uh, crisis communications and addressing stockholders, um, those transcend geographic or industrial space. What I find particularly interesting is this is an ethics competition and Daniels prides itself in embedding ethics in every one of our courses. A hugely valuable experience for us um, to be able to present to a panel of very senior uh, management because when I think about what we all want to do post MBA it's, it's exactly that. We want to have the seat at the table, the presence in a boardroom to be able to present our findings to senior people that will be able to take these and implement them and really drive forward our companies or our clients' companies. It's been really fun to watch the skills of these students and to really be thinking in a different manner. They're young, they're really full of energy, and their ideas are kind of open. Third place is Vanderbilt University. Incredibly unique, and you know, not even on top of that, um, you know, I, I think I've done several case competitions during my MBA, uh, and honestly, just incredibly well run. Um, there are some incredible schools here. Second place is the University of Alabama. Talking to the judges after the competition, um, some of the judges said that was a crazy idea, and then other judges said, you know what, Chipotle should be listening to them. Our big winner, the winner of this amazing cup, the University of Florida. We spent a lot of time working. We, I, we did tally up the hours. I don't know if anybody knows the count off the top of our head, but we spent like over 200 hours probably combined between the four of us. It's been so much fun. We've had such a great time. The case has been put on so well. People here have been amazing, just super helpful. We had a really long day of traveling uh, unexpectedly, and we came in and people were so welcoming and accommodating, so it has been great to be here.